George couldn't figure out why Bill was adding dirt to the dirt. <laughs> Compost isn't just dirt. Take leaves, grass, leftover food, mix it in a hole with air, dirt, and water. Compost! <laughs> it didn't smell like leftovers. It's food for plants. After all, plants get hungry, too. Oh. <laughs> uh, wow. <laughs> Thanks for doing the dishes without being asked, George. But I wasn't finished eating. <laughs> well, okay. I'll be in my room reading if you need me. George needed dirt. <laughs> Huntley noticed George. George and dirt. George and dirt and leaves. This was not good. George had it all. It was enough for their plants. But what about the poor lobby plants? What about all the starving plants? George needed to make enough for everybody. <laughs> I didn't buy strawberries. Huntley smelled a tree. Or a watermelon. A watermelon tree? Spaghetti? No. Fruit. Fruit getty? What? Where? <laughs> hey, Hundley. I bet your nose can get to the bottom of this. Hundley's nose was the perfect tool for this job. Why is my flower jar here? <laughs> George? Huh? George, you can make compost in the city, just not in the house. It needs a proper bin. <laughs> so it gets the right amount of air and light and doesn't smell or give me weird dreams. <laughs> We're gonna have a lot of leftover compost. Uh -huh. Did someone say compost? My tropical plants could use some composting. Ooh, compost bins. Oh, my tea roses would love some. <laughs> a few weeks later, the building had the healthiest plants on the block. George, 